The overall goal of these experiments is to illustrate the advantages that simple organisms offer in the study of complex interactions among gene regulatory networks that direct developmental processes. This methodology can help answer key questions in evolutionary and developmental biology, such as how signaling pathways govern cell fate specification along the major embryonic axes in metazoans. One of the main advantages of this methodology is it can be used to efficiently characterize the signaling pathways and the gene regulatory networks that they activate in an in vivo developmental context. Demonstrating this procedure will be Marina martinez Bartolome, Stephanie Burr, and Daisy Grant, graduate students from my laboratory. To begin the experiment, Prepare three millimolar stock solutions of the morpholino oligonucleotides by adding 100 microliters of nuclease-free water into a 300 nanomole morpholino vial. For the first reconstitution, spin down the vial containing the stock oligonucleotide solution for 30 seconds at full speed. Then, briefly vortex the vial and heat it at 65 degrees Celsius for at least five minutes. After heating briefly, vortex the vial and keep the morpholino stock at room temperature for at least one hour. Prepare the injection solution containing morpholino oligonucleotides by combining 20% glycerol as a carrier and 15% fitzidextran. Store the injection solutions at negative 20 degrees Celsius. Heat the morpholino solution at 65 degrees Celsius in a heat block for at least two to five minutes.